What up guys, welcome to my second YouTube video. I'll be doing a Q&A on Twitter and we're just gonna be talking about what you guys want me to answer, so yeah, here we go. Also, look at this lighting though, like, kinda nice. But yeah, so I got my laptop uh, right here, um, logging into Twitter, but yeah, if you guys didn't know, uh, make sure you guys check out my Instagram. That's where most of my stuff is if you really wanna keep updated, but thanks again for 1.3 million on, on a, TikTok and I think 7,000 on YouTube, 150k on Insta, that's wild, thank you. Um, if you're wondering why I'm not wearing a shirt, I never wear a shirt, I just never do. I don't know why, they're uncomfortable, and these tattoos aren't real, so if you guys didn't know that. But I'm pulling up the questions now. All right, so I got a question from Ariana, what are your top three pet peeves? Um, honestly, when people chew their mouth open, when people don't know the difference between your, your, and their, their, and two and two, like the grammatical errors, and probably when people are just rude and think they're better than everyone else. That's the most annoying thing to me. But yeah, sometimes people can be annoying. Uh, what is your type of girl? Okay, I've said this like a hundred times on all my live streams. I do not have a specific type. Um, all I really care about is what she looks like so i mean not what she looks like dang it what what her personality is like so if she's if she's cool and i can vibe with her then like obviously i'm down but if not then it's kind of kind of stupid um i don't really care about looks that much honestly i think it's kind of stupid i think people should just pick their partners based on personality but yeah um what is your biggest dream my biggest dream is to be a part of something big right like just something big that I can be really proud of and feel accomplished in life. Um, just something where I can look down when I'm in my deathbed, just thinking, you know, I had a great life. Yeah. Um, what's your favorite album or song? My favorite song is All by Cherub, Just One Look by Doris Troy, and I'll Be Seeing You by Tommy Dorsey. Those songs slap so hard. That and Tired of Being Alone by Al Green. Albums, I don't really know. A lot of Frank Sinatra's older albums were my favorite. Uh, I always find those good. Um, but yeah, a lot of soul, old music, jazz, that kind of stuff is what I listen to. Um, say your girlfriend and friends got into a fight and both sides were wrong. Would you choose love or friendship? I would choose friendship because the boys were there before she was there, or at least I'm assuming. Whoever was there with me longer, I would choose because I want to make sure that I stay true to myself. Um, what is your best childhood memory? My best childhood memory. Ooh, probably just me playing outside with my best friends, like with Nerf guns and running around on our bikes, just like exploring stuff. Those are always the best times, honestly. Um, when we visit the Philippines, hopefully next year, it's supposed to be this summer, but Corona's going on, so not anytime soon. Yeah. Um, let's see, which part of London do you live in? I don't want to say exactly, but I'll say west side. The west side of London. Would you date one of your fans? Prefer someone that based on your private life, for instance, outside of TikTok? Um, honestly, if I can buy with her and if I like her, then I don't really, I don't really care where you're from, if you're from my private life or from... Like TikTok doesn't really make a big deal to me. Yeah. Do you prefer people calling you Paolo or Torvas? I prefer Paolo, just because that's my name. I don't care if you call me Torvas. Like, honestly, it's kind of cool that people call me Torvas. But, like, honestly, it doesn't really matter. Also, I'm, like, looking into myself and at the camera. So, if I'm, like, I'm sorry. It's probably really annoying. I'm so confused about your nationality. You live in the UK, but you have USA passport. And you said that you're from Guam. I just want to know what is your nationality. Thank you. I hope you answer this on your YouTube channel from Sansa. I like your name, Sansa. But, okay. I was born in Guam. Moved to the Philippines. Moved to the US. Moved back to the Philippines. Moved to the US. Moved to the UK. Moved back to the US. Moved back to the UK. So, nationality-wise, I'm just Filipino-American. Because I, I have a Filipino passport and an American passport, but I've lived... In the UK, Guam, Philippines, and USA. So, hope that clears it up. What's your favorite Filipino food? That's a tough one. It's a real tough one. That's a, that's super tough. Probably adobo. Adobo or dinaguan. 
I don't really know. Honestly, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. There's a lot. Maybe just rice. It's so like versatile. But I came out. This lighting's kind of. This lighting kind of smacks, dude. Not gonna lie, it's pretty nice. Um, what is love? I don't know. I don't know what love is. I don't know. I thought I had it one time. I don't think I did. Love is. I don't know. I think you just know when you. When you know. You know? Yeah. Love is like a rosary full of mystery. <laughs> yeah. Um, what's the best thing that ever happened to your life? Being born. Nice to have a life, I guess. Uh, do you have a hidden talent? No, but my thumbs can go like this. Like, they can move around. I don't know if that's a hidden talent. I'm also really flexible. Like, look at my arm, it bends. I'm also, like, really, I don't know. Like, I can turn my hand all the way around. Oh! Yeah, like... Yeah, I guess that's my head. You can say that's my head and tell. Um, what are your pet peeves? Hope you'll get to notice me. I've already answered that. Um, who is Hazel Jusso in your life? I have no idea. I think it's one of my supporters. Hello, Hazel. Can you suggest 10 old songs you like to listen best or listen every morning? Honestly, any song by Frank Sinatra. So good. So good. Um, what makes you laugh the most, my friends? Milo. Milo makes me laugh the most, not gonna lie. Milo, Milo Petzolano. If you guys know, he's the guy who's always in uh, the Zoom calls and just my, he's just my best friend. He's always on uh, playing games with me. He's, he's funny, so he's so funny. Um, what's your weird habits? I have like OCD, so if I don't have like a certain, I don't think I have OCD, but I just, I'm superstitious. Um, so if I don't have like my glass somewhere it needs to be that it usually is, it makes me crazy. Something about it, I guess. Favorite song right now? Tired of being alone by Al Green. Reggae, reggae is growing on me though. Like reggae music, low key growing on me. What's the best blessing from God you've received? My family. Easy. Um, do you have any favorite fan account? If so, let's. Not really. Um, I really like Jung KTH's edits. They're really good. Um, a lot of fan art's amazing. I don't want to say I have a favorite because you guys are all amazing. Um, but yeah. What do you hate most in your personality? Sometimes I'm super, I don't know. I'm just really out of it sometimes. Like I'll just, I'll zone out a lot. Does that make sense? Yeah, I'll zone out. How many girlfriends have you have ever had? I don't know, honestly. I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know, man. Have you ever watched your own TikTok video with your friends? Just curious how they react. Yeah, they cringe. Um, they get used to the little, like, Zach Statler, my roommate, and Kyle Tempest, one of my best friends, and just all the other guys, like Caleb, Nate, Ben, Jace, Jane, Gonzo, etc. Uh, so, Mike is here. <laughs> um, we all just cringe at my videos. They get used to it, though, I think. Like, I don't think they cringe that much anymore. Like, there's a point where, like, they were cringing a lot, but now that they know me, it's like they don't care. You know, like, they just, they're just you're so used to seeing it. Um, what made you think of going to TikTok? Brooke Jones. I was on Yubo and Brooke Jones was my friend on Yubo. And she's like, you got to start TikTok. She helped me make my first video. Taught me transitions, trending songs, e-boy moves. Like I used to go like that. Like, but yeah. What is your major? I'm a pro flight major, aviation management major, and drone science major. I don't know if I'm going to keep my triple major. For sure going to double major, but right now I'm triple majoring. Um, how did you think of the name Torvas? Torres Vasquez. My middle name and my last name combined is Torvas. So originally my TikTok username was I am Paolo Miguel, but now it's just Torvas because I am Paolo Miguel was just like super long. And I want something short and like cool. For example, like Zarbra and Z Smitty. I looked up to them by the way. Like they were my they were like my um, my idols when I started TikTok. But they all had short usernames. I was like, you know, what? I'm gonna try Torvas, Torres Vasquez, and it sounds pretty cool. Like everyone likes it, so I'm happy about that. Um, if you had to choose between teletransportation or reading minds, what would you choose? Easy. Easy. Teleport, teleport transportation or teleportation. That would be so fun. Oh my God. You think of all the places I can go to. But yeah, those are all the questions I've got for today. Um, thank you guys so much for all the support. I love you guys. Make sure you guys check out my Instagram at iipaolo.ii. Hit up my recent on Instagram. Check out my TikTok, Torvas. But yeah, I hope you guys have a great day. Thank you all so much for the support. I don't say this enough, but I really do love each and every one of you. Peace out.